Hey guys, Gary here with you again from Signature Laser Designs. And today is Saturday. Um, I was uh, rummaging through my uh, samples drawer here a little bit ago, and I ran up on this uh, this bullet bottle opener uh, that we've got listed in our Etsy shop. We sell these for groomsmen's gifts or for guy gifts, birthday gifts, um, just a ton of different stuff that uh, you can give these for. You know, depending on how you personalize them. I'm going to show you a little uh, a little more of a close up here in a minute, but while I was here, I thought what I could do is show you how to care for these. Um, they are uh, very durable. I mean, it's a, it's a repurposed um, uh, caliber 50 size round. Um, it's the real deal. It's the real brass. And there's a company, we buy these from a company that cuts them into this shape. And uh, they, put, they press the bullets back in. It has no powder or primer in it. But they press the bullet back in it. It makes a really nice bottle opener so, uh, and a nice gift as well. But uh, over time, brass, like any brass, it starts to tarnish. And uh, I, I've got some different types of brass cleaner that I clean my brass with. But the easiest thing you can do, I just jumped over to uh, YouTube for a quick way to clean it because I'm out of my regular brass cleaner right now. And they've got this vinegar solution that you use. All you do is just pour vinegar uh, in a pan or something, let it soak a little bit for about five minutes and then polish it. And uh, it comes up with a, with a very nice shine, as you can see here. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit here so you can see a little more about what I'm talking about. Um, this one, I don't remember why we didn't uh, didn't ship this one, but it was for a best it was for a best man for a wedding party, and the guy's name evidently was Crumbs. Um, but anyways, um, it was really I wish I would have waited and done this on the video, but I went ahead and polished it up, and you can see how shiny it is. The other thing you can do is we engrave these uh, pretty deep, so. Over time, the ink comes out of them, and um, all you have to do is, when they get a little bit worn, all you have to do is take a black sharpie and just cover over your uh, cover over your engraving. And you can see how I co colored it there. And then the next thing you're going to want to do is take a take an eraser. Grab my eraser here. I'm just going to put it down here for a second where I can erase it, erase it back off of the. Top. It doesn't take it out of the engraving. You're just erasing around the word. It takes a little bit of elbow grease, but when you're done, it uh, it'll re-ink your engraving. So that's basically how you uh, how you maintain them. You can clean them once in a while, and then re-ink them, and they look great. You can beat them up, throw them in a drawer, put them in your purse, throw them in the boat. Um, your truck, glove box, you know, wherever you're going to need a bottle opener. But these are, um, these work pretty good. All you do, I've got a, a uh, I'm not going to open this because this is sort of like a collector's thing. I bought this at Walmart a few years ago and I just thought it's cool. I'm not going to open it, but all you do is take your bottle opener and you put it on the lip and you pull up on it and it opens it, you know, instantly. There's very few bottles that I found that this thing won't open. In fact, I've never found a bottle that this thing won't open. But uh, they make really good gifts. Now, let me talk to you about the listing a little bit. There is an option here for you to select uh, your font type. So if you want more of a scripty look, depends on what you're giving it for. Um, you can pick script or Arial. There's Times New Roman. And if we don't have the font choice you want, all you got to do is send us a message, and we'll try to try to get you the font choice that you want. But um, we have plenty of these in stock right now, so uh, you can order them, and we'll get them to you as soon as possible. Um, but these make, like again, these things make really great groomsmen's gifts. Um, everybody seems to love them. We even have one here for Valentine's Day. It's just a Valentine's Day theme. So you can turn these into anything that you want. Just you know, depend on what you want to, depend on what you want us to put on there for you. But uh, anyway, I appreciate you guys hanging with me today on this Saturday, and I will be back with you next week. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel because we're continuously putting out new videos, and I want to make sure that you don't miss a great gift idea. This is Gary signing off here with Central Laser Designs. We'll see you next week.